Good morning, friends. I got my coffee and I'm ready for a fun filled day here at Universal Orlando. So I haven't really done anything here and I'm very excited to try it out. So let's go explore and see what Universal has to offer. I'm already like really loving the dramatic theatrical music. It's my thing. We're actually gonna start our day rope dropping at Islands of Adventure to see if we can get on the new Hagrid's Magical Motorbike Adventure. So I'll let you know how that goes once the rope drops. It's about 15 minutes before the park opens and the line is pretty long to get on already. Luckily we got here a lot earlier, like an hour earlier, and we're almost in front of this line. So I just came back here because I had to go to the bathroom, but um, and to show you guys how long the line is. So I would say get here at least an hour before the park opens to line up. Welcome. The Hagrid's was down, so now we're riding um, the flight of the Hippogriff. And we get our own row, because there's like no one here. awesome um even if Hagrid's was up they said it would still be like a longer wait at rope drop than it would be like later throughout the day they said it won't drop below 60 minutes anyway so we went to fly to Hippogriff which was five minutes and we rode it four times in 20 minutes and now we're all happy as soon as you leave Hogsmeade you can hear it already welcome to Jurassic Park Thank <laughs> you. 
bummer that they made me put my phone away for the drop, but you get very wet. I'm terrified to do this, but I think I'm gonna try. I'm so scared. I think I might feel like I'm gonna throw up. <sighs> I'm such a scaredy cat. Like I know it's not real, but it's gonna feel real. She is gonna see direct eye contact as a form of aggression. Also, please, no touching. She will see that as a sign of aggression as well. Oh, and any basic talking or breathing, she is going to see as a sign of aggression. <laughs> How many, you guys? We're watching the people in front of us. Oh, my gosh. This is so scary. Oh, my God. Look at this. It's like creeping up on us. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, I can't even watch it without being scared. It's a trigger for me too, thanks for being She has taken a liking to you. Ladies and gentlemen, cover your children's eyes, the mating process. Oh my god! Let's use first, because I'm the talent. Right this way. Perfect. Now on the count of three, you're going to bend up in the eyes! Oh my god. Damage. Go, go. Push you in towards, and then back up. Three steps back. You guys, I do want to make sure she attacks. She eats you first, because I'm the challenge. I'm like getting you in the video. You're in it. Okay. Now on the count of three, you're going to go. That was straight up terrifying. Who did she bite? She me. bit somebody. She bit me. Oh my god. <laughs> did you video it? I did. Or I yeah, tried to. Video. It's only 10 minutes. Yeah. Gulls everywhere. This is really a small island. It's not scary at all. <laughs> this isn't scary? Uh huh. Huh. The queue line seems like it's gonna be scary. No, it's not scary. There will be no sacrifice today. We hope. Oh, no. Hey! 
and she's right in front of us. Oh, spirit, protect us. Don't make a sound. Don't even breathe. makes it the broth under the top. It's really, really good. It tastes like a butterscotch, like a Werther's original in a liquid form. It's very yummy. We're headed over to the Hogwarts Express. You do have to have a park to park pass because the other side, Diagon Alley, is in Universal Studios and Hogsmeade is in Islands of Adventure. for dragon. Okay, who wants to see that seen this show already? My brother and he's got a wand and a map. It comes with a map when you buy it. One side is Diagon Alley and the other side is Hogsby. And they tell you like the moves to do and how to do it. So I'm going to try to figure it out and show you guys. When you come up on one of the magic areas, it'll tell you on the ground what move to do as well.
stopping into the Today Cafe to get some lunch because they have like lighter food here. I'll show you what they have. They have a bunch of different pastries and cookies. So I feel like this would be a good breakfast um, place. Here is a look at all the different salads that they have. I got the salad, so I'll tell you how it is in a minute. Um, they have a bunch of different sandwiches as well. So lots of different options, but still like lighter than like you know, burgers and fries and stuff. And then they have some really sweet looking, like these look really good. And a green tea matcha cream puff. Oh, that's good too. Oh my gosh, look at that cake. Mm. And then these are some drink options or you can get like a set up there. Something a little crazy about Universal is that most of the rides you have to, I mean, it's free, but you have to rent a locker by using your part key and putting it up here and then it opens and you have to put all your stuff inside to ride the ride and then come back and get it when you're done. So a little bit of out of the wayness, but I guess you don't have to carry your backpack for 20 minutes. Straight on through, rookie, straight on through. <laughs> oh, yes. I love these guys. Now the My brain has lost. We have one of those like animal actor shows, so I'm gonna watch it and see how they teach the animals to act. Try again. 
have it. That was my day at Universal Orlando exploring Universal Studios and Islands of Adventure for the first time. It was so fun. I am so grateful for all the friends that I made on that trip and glad that I got to meet up with some family while I was there. It was so amazing. I think we're going to have to plan our own family trip there soon. So what do you guys think? Have you been to Universal? Is it one of your favorite places? Let me know down in the comments and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye!